Hey you guys! Oh my gosh, today I have a thrifting haul for you. You like to go thrifting because I am obsessed with it and it's like one of those things I wish I could do every single day but if I did then it would add up and I'd probably be spending more money than I want to be spending but it is such a good way to find like really cool things, unique things um, and really I find a lot of nice stuff thrifting and I just actually this week found out about a thrift store okay I'm kind of sad because I've been missing out on it for two years like I've lived here for two years and I've driven by it and I had no idea that it was even a thrift store it says thrift outlet so I should have known but I didn't and they fill up the whole store with new merchandise every Wednesday night and then on Thursday morning when they open all day like for all day Thursday every single thing in the store is two dollars no matter what it is everything is the same price it's two dollars and then they knock a quarter off the price every day of the week and until the next Wednesday. And then on Wednesdays everything is 25 cents. And then they close the store at noon on Wednesdays and just restock everything and then on Thursday reopen again. So it's like, and they have some really nice stuff there. I was nervous. I, I wasn't sure if I was going to find anything. I went today, which is a Saturday, um, and for the first time. And so everything was $1.50. I've heard that you know it's best to go on Thursdays, so I'm gonna have to try going on a Thursday sometime. But I still did find some really cute things, and that is just a clothing thrift store, clothes and shoes. Um, and then I've also been to Goodwill and to another thrift store in my area in the last week. So I'm just gonna show you all of the cool stuff that I got. Um, I'm super excited. It's just been a really good week for thrifting. So without further ado. Um, at the thrift outlet, I got this. This is my first thing I got. It's this striped three-quarter length like scoop neck t-shirt, and it's a J. Crew one, and it's it's really nice. It's kind of white and black stripes, and basically if it's striped, I'm down with it. I love stripes, and this, so I got this. Um, I got two just really plain sweatshirts. These are, I just like to buy these sometimes. If you read Pretty Prominence over the holidays, you would have seen I did a post about making ugly sweaters, making your own, and I use like old sweatshirts like this that I find at thrift stores to make those. So I got these for that for this year so I can make some, some more cool sweaters um, for the holidays. Um, I also got this chambray t-shirt dress. Uh, I thought this was really cute. And it's, this is from The Gap, so it's also really nice. Um, I got another Gap thing. This is another striped, just one of their V-neck t-shirts, which this is actually kind of what I live in, just like striped t-shirts. I'm wearing a different striped t-shirt every day. Oh, and I got something from my husband. He, it's actually funny. He used to never wear uh, polo shirts. He just didn't like them. And now he wears them almost every day because he is an engineer and he needs to look professional, but they don't really have a specific dress code, so he just likes to do like the whole snappy casual thing. And so I got him this. It's a J. Crew polo shirt and it's red, which is his favorite color. And yeah, it's really nice. They had another one that was green, but I didn't get it for him because I didn't know the shade of green. It was kind of iffy. So I didn't, but I'm kind of wondering if I should have now because it turns out that he really likes it and oh and I, I love this I got this this is an old navy uh, blouse it's really light and I think it's kind of a summer blouse it's kind of a linen material and you know uh, like light aqua and white stripes and it's the buttons go just about halfway down they don't go all the way so down to the bottom it's not buttoned um I love this and I thought this would be really cute with jeans or I have this navy skirt that I think it'll be really cute with. I'm excited to wear that. Um, so, oh, and I have some things that aren't clothes too to show you. And oh, by the way, I'm saving the best things for last. And so, um, I always, well, it's hard for me to get out of a thrift store without buying some kind of picture frame. So I got three picture frames. I got this one, which is technically a Target one, but somebody never used it apparently and just donated it. So win for me. I like this natural wood look. Um, and then I also got a white one and a silver one. And I seriously, this thrift 
for your picture frames, please, because they are so cheap and there's so many to choose from. You can find unique ones, you can find plain ones, old, new. I mean, picture frames are like probably, <laughs> probably the most donated thing. That and like sports t-shirts. Anyway, so, but frames, I never pay more than a dollar for a frame that's you know, 8 by 10 or smaller, and then even the bigger ones all pay maybe like $5 sometimes for like a really big frame, but they can be so cheap, and it's just, you can find really nice frames at thrift stores, so that's where I recommend buying your frames. I got a couple little baskets. Um, I got this pink one that's actually, I'm going to keep in this room. I'm technically in my daughter's room right now, and I just thought this little pink thing would be cute for the nightstand to keep like lotion and stuff in. I don't know. And then this little, I thought I liked this little basket. I have some new shelves downstairs in my living room that I'm going to put this basket on. I think it's cute. I don't know. Maybe I'll put a plant in there, uh, probably. Or like a candle. I don't know. What should I do with this, guys? Leave a comment. Tell me what I should do with it. I just thought it was really cute. And it was like 50 cents, so. And I got some uh, baby Einsteins. These were two bucks. I actually got three of them and downstairs right now. One of them is entertaining my child. And my husband, I just went down and checked and they're both asleep. So, go baby Einstein. <laughs> uh, but yeah, no, I've, I've been wanting to try these for a while. I heard a lot of good things about baby Einstein, but hadn't wanted to splurge on like the DVDs yet. So, there they were at Grand Willow for $2 each. So, I'm excited about that one. And last but not least, drum roll please. Okay, I hope you guys don't think this is weird. Like, these are so cool, I think, but I don't know. I just kept thinking, what would Emily Henderson do? And I think she would buy them. And I even didn't, I didn't even buy them at first. And I, I tweeted to, like, just the Twitterverse and asked, please advise someone tell me, like, should I buy these or should I not buy them? I couldn't decide. And so I, I ended up getting, like, four responses telling me that I should. And then I kept thinking about it and I really wanted them, so I came back the next day to get them and like they had been marked down 50% the next day. So I actually got really lucky in waiting. Normally I don't recommend waiting if you find something in the thrift store that you just love. You should probably buy it. Well, if it's not super expensive because you know it probably won't be there. But I got really lucky. So. Da -da -da -da! Lamps! What do you guys think about these? I think they are so cool. They're like this really interesting geometric situation with kind of a crystal-y looking base and navy drum shades and there's like kind of a crystal thing on the top and honestly I couldn't believe there was a pair of them it's really hard to find matching lamps in any kind of discount setting like but you always want two if you're putting them on nightstands or like you know places in your house where you might need two lamps instead of one so I I seriously think these are so cool and I feel like and maybe I'm wrong but I really feel like this is something I would see Emily Henderson use in one of her like styling shoots so I just I could not stop thinking about them and I like went back and got them and actually they look really cute in my master bedroom so I'm excited but when my husband first saw them he was like what is this like these are weird but then when I put them up in our room and he saw them with all the rest of the stuff we have, they actually kind of match really nicely and he was like, oh, okay, yeah, I can see what you're talking about, but boys, they just don't understand sometimes, right? So there you go. Tell me, what do you think about these lamps? Do you hate them? It's okay if you do. Tell me if you hate them. Tell me if you love them. Tell me how you would style them because right now I just have them on my, on my nightstands, but I mean, maybe there's something cooler that I could do. Maybe I could get new lampshades. I don't know. I like the lampshades though. Fifteen dollars for the pair. Fifteen dollars for two lamps that match. Have you ever heard of it? Goodness gracious. So anyway, that's my my thrifting haul. It was such a good week. Okay, so if you like this video, go ahead and hit subscribe down below. We're gonna have more hauls coming at you. We're gonna have thrifting hauls, yard sale hauls. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.